Just another failed simulation in my attempts to give Mr. Masrani the cooler dinosaurs he's asked for. But I think I figured out the problem. Really? Because I've been cross-checking against our files, going over the gene sequencing and calculations, and I think there might be a flaw in our DNA sample. No, it's our computers. They are clearly faulty. I really doubt it's the computers, Dr. Wu. You just take I'm certain it's the computers. I'm going down to technical support to insist repairs are done right away. <sighs> Maybe if we rearrange this peptide string like this... <gasps> That's it! Hello? Mr. Farrington? Anyone? Whoa, what was this? An industrial crane winch. They were used in the building of both Jurassic Park and World. That is one weird kid. Ugh, it's cold. Wish I'd brought my jacket. Don't worry, Scaredy Claire. Maybe we'll find some answers in Farrington's trailer. I shivered because I'm cold, not scared. I'm not scared either. Owen says fear is an instinct that reveals weakness, and predators can sense it and take advantage. That's why I try to project beast-like strength. That is one weird kid. Thank goodness you're here. Forrest? What happened? It was terrible. Awful. It started with a chill. A chill like I've never felt. And then a horrible, invisible presence was suddenly in our midst. Ah! Ah! I had no idea what was happening. I have no idea what's happening! It's the spirit everyone talks about! It's returned to destroy us all! According to the workers, long before John Hammond brought dinosaurs to this island, it was home to a ghost. A ghost who doesn't tolerate mortals in his territory. I thought it was just a joke, but now... Yeah, okay. You guys don't believe this is a ghost, do you? Absolutely. Well... Okay, I'd expect Hudson to maybe believe he's a kid. But Owen, you're a man. Chronologically. A man of science, no less. I don't know, Claire. I don't like to rule anything out. When I was in the Navy, I went all over the world, and I saw a lot of strange things no one could explain. Ghosts are not real. There are four telltale signs of a ghost infestation. One, a sudden drop in temperature. Two, weird noises. Three, trophies taken from the victims. And four, people who believe in made-up nonsense. Four, is objects moving on their own. Like that. I don't know. You know how I tell you to pay attention to your instincts like dinosaurs do? Uh-huh. Well, my instincts are telling me we're not dealing with a ghost. Owen, you're pretty much my idol and everything, but your instincts clearly need to tune up. I'm with Owen, but not because of any instinct. In my experience, if you look closely enough, there's always a rational, non-ghosty explanation for any occurrence. Notice anything missing? C-15 polished titanium stabilizing bolt. Manufactured in Gary, Indiana at... I think we're dealing with a disgruntled construction worker upset about working triple shifts, not a ghost. And I know about working triple shifts. Everyone out here, line up now! All right, I get it. The hours are long, the pay is low, the work is hard, and I'm sure sometimes we all wonder why we even do this when we could be taking bubble baths. Uh... Never mind. Point is, one of you has let your bad attitude put your fellow workers at serious risk. Who sabotaged the treetop villas? Uh... Was it you, Marcus? 